Today's video is about Parallel 16 and how it keeps crashing. I'm going to show you how to stop it so you can carry on working without having to worry. So let's get started. So first I want to show you that we are using Parallel 16 and as you may see it is the latest version and also it is due to renew on the 5th of December so I wanted to make sure I could find a solution and I did just that so let me just show you what happened so first if we start up a session here that's been currently suspended so you may see it'll start up quickly but that's only because we had it suspended but normally it'll take a little bit of time depending on the spec of your machine this is a MacBook Pro 15 inch 2015 model with 16 gig RAM and it's got all the ports that's why we still keep this one around but as you can see I'm going to show you now if I launch a browser now I didn't actually even get time to type anything but sometimes you get a little bit of time to type something but it just doesn't ever load and then it comes to a suspended state so it'll do this circle around for a little bit so once it's finished we can show you what it does next what it's actually doing is it's gathering up some data so you can actually send a technical report to Parallels so they can try and look into fixing unfortunately as of today being the 9th of November they actually still haven't fixed it so as you can see here you can either send it or if you click the X it will start up again What we're going to do, I'm just going to stop it. I actually didn't get a chance to stop it. You see, this is exactly the point. It could do this over and over again. So now we're going to have to wait again. Because for anyone who's not familiar with uh, Parallels, while it's doing this, you can't actually interact with any option. Um, on here this menu other than the one you're in suspend menu so as soon as this comes back to life before it's actually had a chance uh, to do anything we're gonna stop it we do need to be in a state that's working so we can just stop it there so Windows 10 Pro is now stopped so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna add in what you do is you got you right click on your machine you go to configure and then make sure from the options at the top make sure you're under hardware and then boot order and then select the advanced options and what you're going to do is in the boot flags all you have to do is copy this into there so video dot metal equals zero and then just click the X and then you're good to go and start up so as it boots up it may take a little bit of time depending on the spec of your machine so I'm restart the video as soon as we get back in thank you okay we're back so I'm just going to open up Firefox and just demonstrate now before it would crash on any application that you're going to launch or, or if you're going to go into a browser and you start typing so I'm just going to go to Google demonstrate there we go it loaded we close that and then if I just open up file explorer you'll get your normal file explorer open there so there you go um, now we're back to normal and once you've finished you can just suspend the virtual machine so for more videos like that, if you subscribe to our channel, we'll be updating regularly and adding new content. Thank you for your time.